Hello everyone, today we're featuring Skylinks from the Earthrise series. Uh, as you can see, we're in its alt form, a space shuttle with its transport module in the below, which is attached to the space shuttle. So, um, this one actually rolls, it's got wheels underneath. Um, these wheels are attached in the middle part of it, so those tank threads really does not make it re roll or something. But and this one's an accessory you can attach in the shoulders or in the thighs. When the one you also use as defense when it's in base mode. It's got a NASA logo. Mine's got a scratch on the left side. And the name of the space shuttle, which is um, Magnificence. It's got some color trimmings of gray and gold. Yep, pretty neat design. Really looks like a space shuttle. G1 look. And it's got panels like those of um, satellite and stuff, and thrusters. So yep, here it is in its alt form, Skylinks in its magnificence mode. I'm going to try to transform him, <clears throat> separate him. See there's a tab that separates the space shuttle from the mobile. So those are two tabs that you can attach so that it keeps and it holds together. So let's put the space shuttle got some landing gears as well and it's a rolling landing gear it's got really wheels that you could attach you could roll it as well yep so there he is space shuttle oh my wheel just fell off let me fix that <clears throat> okay so that's the shuttle part, half part, and a mobile base. Well, well, we'll turn this into a base mode. Um, I actually prefer him not having those like, towers, so we just spread the shoulders a bit and turn where the treads are so that it's the one on the ground. <clears throat> Then we split open, it's got some tabs in it. Oh, and um, the joints for the shoulders and the legs, um, they're ratcheted. Oops, this one fell off again, sorry. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's not loose, it's just, I think I twisted it too much. Yep, so this is how you put up with a, with a tower, but I prefer it facing down so that all the treads are on the ground. Doing the other side as well. I'll remove that accessory for now. Yeah. So I prefer him in this base mode, just like Fortress Maximus. <clears throat> and with the thrusters, you could put it in this slot, stand him there like he's about to, be, to take off. <clears throat> Uh, let me open the. <clears throat> this is a like a bridge or the ramp. You can actually uh, attach ironworks here as well. Create your own base. Yeah, this one's kind of tight. Uh, the ramp. Oh, something fell off. So this is the other part of the ramp that fell off. Well, it's just a slide on ramp. Too easy to take it out. We can just put it back in. And so you stand the shuttle there like it's about to get ready for takeoff. You can open the shuttle's center apart, like the carriage system. This looks like it's carrying a lot of satellite or something. 
There we go. And is got to zoom out a bit so that you could see the whole thing. So there he is, Skylink's ready to take off. So now here he is back in his module mode. So we're going to transform him into the, the cat version, the, the Lynx, as they call. This kind of reminds me <clears throat> like one of those Zoids Liger. So, yep, the, the shoulder, you could pop it off, make it wider, give it a more muscular feel for the <clears throat> For the cat version or lion, or I don't know what they call this, uh, just links. So the tread hold up as the foot of the cat, and it's also ratcheted, which is good. Everything's sturdy. It's got those. I don't know, is it the tail or twin? Now we pop up the head. The head is movable, it's got its jaw that you could open as well. Here. So here is the lion version, yep. So there, you can also attach one of those blaster if blast effects in its mouth, like it's spewing fire or something. So yeah, some people prefer the accessory on the hips or on the shoulder. Yep, so there are Skylinks, <clears throat> the cat cat version so here are the blast effects that comes with it <clears throat> so yeah you could attach it the, from his tongue it's like spewing fire they, they come a lot of with that bloosh that's what MGO calls them so now we transform the space shuttle into its eagle form. So first we attach the blast effect on its thrusters as well. <clears throat> oh, that one's too big. Um, yeah, there we go. So there, space shuttle in flight. Pretty neat size for this toy. I like the size of this one. So now let's transform him into his eagle mode. First we pop this up and slide out <clears throat> the tail and put it back in. Then there's a tab that holds the wings. Take that out. The other side as well. You can see the logo is also in gold. It's pretty neat. Very majestic. How about the wings as well? Slide them up, make them bigger. Then we pop up the legs. It's very tight actually, which is very nice. <clears throat> so let's put the first uh, right foot and the left foot. Could actually also expand or widen the angle of the legs. So here you just pull out the head for the eagle and its mouth it opens up as well. It's got that tongue where you could also put <clears throat> the blaster effects. There you go. Let's make the legs wider so you could stand up a bit. Wings are kind of heavy though. So you have to find a the right balance for it to stand on its own. There. So there. Sorry, my table is kind of slippery and shaky as well. So here it is, the eagle and the lion together. What's nice about this commander class figure is that you get two figures in one. You may not have a bot mode, but you have, you know, primal mode or primitive mode or eagle and a lion. So let's turn him back to the shuttle mode, um, part of the shuttle mode or just clip back the legs so we could combine them together. <clears throat> yeah, 
up so it's pretty easy just have to slide it right angle and it just there you go so that's the top part and then we hide the lion's head put it back in and by the way this is very possible turns left and right I think it's got a ball joint in it slide them back in so that could put the tab back in and Have him in this dragon, dragon mode, or a sphinx or something. Yeah, I prefer to call it the dragon. Skylinks in all his glory. Mister Commander, modesty. So here he is with Optimus Prime, hmm. for for size comparison, how big he is, Hound, uh, Deluxe Class version, this one's the Netflix version as well. I don't have the original Hound, or uh, so that's I have nothing to compare it with, just this one. So I don't know the comparison between the Netflix and the regular Siege Hound. A bit, a bit of effect from his mouth his head is in a ball joint peg as well pretty neat and here he is in comparison with um, Skyfire Jetfire um, he's much bulkier but he's much shorter compared to Jetfire and here's Optimus Prime again. Um, thank you for watching my videos. Hope to see you again soon.